annoying when your computer crashes. Oh, it's so frustrating, isn't it? Spare thought for Stephen Hawking. His whole <laughs> life crashes. <laughs> I, I, I also want to know, how does he let the carers know he's crashed? So they just stand and they're going, Stephen's been quiet last few days. <laughs> you right, you right, Stephen? Control, I'll delete, control, I'll delete. <laughs> Nothing. Just, uh, I don't know, change it. Should we have a look at these genitals? Just, uh, okay, bring, bring the bright torch, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So there's lots of crime in Southampton, I've noticed, because there's, there's constantly police cars whizzing around and ambulances. There's so much crime. Statistically, two of you are involved in a crime right now, and one and a half of you are in, in the middle of a rape. <laughs> um, yeah, there's so much crime. There's so many police cars wandering about, and I've realised what people do when they see a police car go by. They kind of be in a conversation in seat and some, somehow become in some kind of trance-like state and just stare at it as it walks by. Just like, oh Gregory, what's your opinion of taxes? It na 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 in modern society. Everybody does it. Even the policemen do it. Okay, Osama bin Laden, I'm arresting you for littering. Um, getting annoyed with this. Um, I've called for backup and na 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 na. Hey, where'd he go? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, oh, I don't, don't want to appear preachy, um, but uh, I've got to get something off my chest. Uh, I get really annoyed if people take me out to sex here, because I've got a cousin, Brendan, who's a sexy, and he's a really funny guy. He's really quick witted and really naturally funny. I'm actually trying to get him on my uh, comedy course, and um, he's one of the people who can read the phone book out loud and make it funny. Mainly because he's dyslexic. <laughs> he gets stuck in the first page. <laughs> it's the Aaron's, two ways in a row. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Has anyone noticed, uh, why do they play that e same E music at amusement parks, amusement arcades? You'd just be walking along and you'd be like, dum, 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 dum. Is that, is that you? Dum, 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 dum. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, it's a claw machine. Um, why, why pick that song? Out of all the songs in the world, it sounds like it should be an official theme for paedophile stalking or something. Dun, 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 dun. Nice bum. Dun, 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 dun. Do you want some sweets? Dun, 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 dun. I'm a friendly postman. Dun, 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 dun. Um, yeah, it's crazy. And that's why there's so many paedophiles at arcades. They, uh, they hate the children, love the music. <laughs> um, yeah. So, my next point. Claw, yeah, the claw machines themselves. You know, the ones that pick up the cuddly toys. I hate them because your attempt to walk past them, you won't be able to because you have to have a go. You always think, no, I'm not going to be a mug, I'm not going to be a mug. Oh, okay, one go, one go. They're like madness, and you always have a go. And first you think, oh, this is easy. Look, it's a claw if you do that. Eight quid later, for fuck's sake! <laughs> look, I, I asked you to go left. You couldn't have gone more right. Oh, if it wasn't for this attractive music in the background, I'd smash this place up, okay? And I'd take it out on like my, my little sister or whatever. She'd be like, Luke, can I have a go? And I'd be like, for fuck's sake, okay, then no. You're putting me off. Look, go play with them weird dancing men. Look, there's a friendly postman, you like them? Go on. What other machines were there? Ah, the token machines, the token machines. The one where you play the same machine all holiday, just for the tokens, the tokens would come out, they'd flutter out, be the equivalent to the arcade cum shot. Oh, tokens, 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 tokens. <laughs> <laughs> and on the last day of the holiday, you would collect all your, your, all your tokens and count them up, and you go up to the amusement man, you run to him and go, Mr, Mr, I've got 5,000 tokens, what can I get, what can I get? You can get five crayons or a novelty hit moustache. What? Really? God, what about, what about that TV? That big TV can have that. You need 10 million tokens for that, okay? <laughs> have you got 10 million tokens? No, they don't exist. Is there anything I could have? Because I'm nice, you can have this novelty nursery rhyme recorded by the Beach Boys. Do you want to have a listen? Shh. Bar, 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 black sheep. <laughs> it's okay. I just had the moustache. <laughs> um, Hitler. Hitler was involved in World War II, little known fact. And um, a lot of people don't give Britain enough credit uh, in World War II. They always say, oh, America saved us. They didn't, they didn't. England, Britain had, had a welfare plan all the way through which distracted the Germans. Oh, I show you, look, I'm a German gunman. I have the perfect shot of Winston Churchill to win the war for Deutschland. Try, smile, 
Dun 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 dun. What is that? Dun 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 dun. Oh, the claw machine. Up now, I'm busy. Dun 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 dun. Okay, one go, one go. <laughs> right. Uh, what are the prizes? Um, novelty Hitler mustache, Winnie the Pooh, and uh, how to do a German accent book. I need that book. I really do. <laughs> <laughs> and um. You know, that distracted the Germans, and Winston, Ch Winston Churchill admitted this. Uh, he said, when he said, we'll find them on the beaches, he meant the seaside resorts. <laughs> and so, eventually the entire German army was crowded around this one claw machine, which allowed the British troops to infiltrate them. Okay, come on, Ben, let's uh, infiltrate the German army. Come on, Sergeant Stephen Hawking. But, oh, come on, Stephen. Oh, he's bloody crashed again. <laughs> Stephen, come on. Stephen. Uh, end program now. Dun 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 dun, oh fuck, I killed him. Right, <laughs> right I can't let anything distract me now. Look, I got the perfect shot of Hitler. Well, at least I think that's Hitler. It could have been someone just when I hit the nobody mustache. <laughs> okay, I'll kill him anyway, because I'm British. Um, right, okay. Three, two. <laughs> yeah, I like it, it's nice. So, set up. I bet the person who thought that name was like, I love soul, but not upstairs. <laughs> Only downstairs. <laughs> Just like how Austrians like their daughters. Only downstairs. <laughs> In the dungeons. <laughs> yeah, let's talk about it, eh? <laughs> uh, Austrian father. Yeah, yeah, because he kept his daughter in a dungeon for 24 years and had seven children with her. But that was annoying. <laughs> I mean, and the wife, the wife, the funny thing about the story is the wife claimed she knew nothing of it. She said, she claimed she knew nothing about it. How? How could you not know? She just like, darling, where's our daughter again? I already told you, she, she's going for a walk. A 20 year walk, okay? Now, I'm going down to the dungeon, by which I mean covered to make some bread. By which I mean screwed up the line, I start again. <laughs> I'm gonna make my make some children, by which I mean bread. We got long lost daughter, by which I mean Stephen Hawking. Okay, okay, leave me alone. And this guy, this guy is sick. I mean, what, what was going through his brain? Is it you no? Know, is it right to make a child with a daughter? No, it's not right to make a child with a daughter. I will make seven. <laughs> that is what's right. And and I mean a dungeon. <laughs> Where did he get that idea from? I've been watching too much Crystal Maze, to be honest. <laughs> yes, I love this mid-90s Channel 4 shows. Hey, come on, Dora, it's not a dungeon, it's nice and warm, you like it. Go on, let's play Crystal Maze. So they play, so they play Crystal Maze. Yes, you're gonna get the crystal in time. Three, two, one, so close, so close. Now, the rules of the game are, Dora, you are locked in the dungeon until your other teammates complete the game. But Daddy, there are no other teammates. Then you were locked in there forever! <laughs> hey, don't blame me, I'm written the rules. <laughs> the voice started to turn into everybody that's Raymond then, didn't it? <laughs> Imagine an episode about that! <laughs> hey, come on, Tarapro, where's my lemon chicken? <laughs> that's it, I'll come to church in the dungeon. Well, I'm now a choir, okay. With my proper robber! Yeah. Duh, uh, Raymond. <laughs> hey, Mommy. Who's a pedophile? Yeah. Uh, hey kids, come to Baba. Yeah, come on kids, do what he says. Hey, Ali, um, Michael, Jeffrey, come on, take the ball out. Okay? Do what he says. Hey, come on. You only need to spend good money watching this next show. Come on. Daddy, what's the show called? The show, the show is called, the show's called, Everybody Loves Rimming. <laughs> <laughs> I've been Luke Gray, take a look.